you have more power when it comes to your narcissistic ex than you realize. Let me explain. When a narcissist discards you and leaves you, they want to see that you're still depressed, miserable without them, broken, damseled in distress, however you want to put it. So when they're seeing that you are glowing and you're doing your thing, because they're watching you, you have their uninvited attention. My ex watches me every single day. So when I'm sitting here showing him that I'm leveling up and I'm succeeding, he sees the growth of my platforms. He sees that my business is definitely making a lot of money because I'm showing it. Just for February 2024, I collected $18,133.65 just off of personal readings. This does not include my Keen sponsorship. I made $2,000. That doesn't include my Facebook pay. I made $7,000. That does not include my TikTok. I made $1,000. I'm making over $30,000 in the shortest month of the year, February. How do you think that makes the narcissist feel? Think about it. How does that really make him feel, you think? She is glowing and she is shining. Don't that make them angry? Don't that make them feel dumb? What do you think that does to their new supply in them's relationship? They're now looking at the new supply, realizing that the grass wasn't greener on the other side. And the person that was actually blessed in abundance is the person that they tried to shit on. Most of the time, they try to come back crawling. But guess what? You got the door closed. They can't reach you now because they showed their ass. So they're watching. So what are you going to do with this? What are you going to do? Are you going to still be same, depressed, in the same place, begging for them to come back, posting up subliminal memes and messages, talking about you missed them, posting sad songs? Baby, no. I haven't bought a brand new car off the dealership. <laughs> Baby, I haven't moved to a better apartment since he left my life. I actually moved twice, moved to LA. I was living in the heart of Hollywood in California and California is not cheap. Now I live in another town that is kind of like countryside and it's nice. My apartment is huge with two parking spots. You feel me? How do you think that makes my narcissistic ex feel? He thought he broke me down. I have his undivided attention. He watches me more than he watched that little white girl that don't talk back. So what am I going to do with this? I'm going to stunt. I'm going to show him that I'm glowing without him and I never needed him. And that one monkey didn't stop this train from rolling. You get what I'm saying? So when I show y'all this stuff, baby, I'm also trying to inspire, but I'm also letting him know, baby, you didn't stop shit. I'm fucking winning. So that's what you do when a narcissist walks away. You level up. You learn to love yourself. You go to the gym. You go back to school. You get in your bag and you show them. You thought you crushed me? No, baby. You only tipped me over for a little bit and I got back up and now I'm stronger. 